on uh, New Year's Eve, there was a uh, event at uh, Fourth Floor Blues Club, Parker Building. The the person at the the entrance the that was uh, taking tickets or uh, accepting people into the building was asked how many people were in the building. He said, oh, about 70 or so. Um, Christine took, took that number, being more than 50. Uh, a scan of it was, was at least 70. Uh, little to no mass, I think the folks that were, were serving food or preparing food were mass. Uh, patrons and whatnot were not having mass. There were no, there was no signage on the door uh, to indicate that mass were required. Mr. Parker was called and um, said he was not going to comply with the order. There was a second, so there was a verbal complaint written up that was prepared and then they asked that if he was not going to uh, comply with the executive order that he close the establishment. Uh, he refused and um, at that point, to not cause a scene, uh, Christine and Dan left the facility. Correct. There was a, a verbal request to comply, a written request to comply. Uh, both were uh, failed to gain uh, compliance, so the uh, written closure order was given to Mr. Parker and we left. It, before we go forward, I, I, I just want to point out, I think the county as a whole is doing a really great job of wearing their masks, social distancing, but it really gets frustrating when you have events and establishments that, that are outliers in this, and we're seeing contact tracing pointing back to these events, and um, we see numbers increase because these events are happening, and we're it's affecting the whole community. It, it doesn't affect just the person at the event. It, it, it affects every person that they contact, and, and there's a whole chain reaction to that. So I, I want to applaud the county as a whole and the community as a whole for, I think, doing a really good job. And I hope that we see events like this cease and we really, um, it's a community effort, everybody involved, not just the ones that want to wear a mask or, or, or try to have their neighbor's best interests at heart. It really is everybody working together in this to really uh, drive our numbers down and protect the whole community.